Hey everybody, Mike Day here with EverythingAboutConcrete.com. In today's video, I'm going to tell you the basic tools you'll need to form and pour a concrete slab. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, Mike here. Now I just wanted to go over what you'll need for tools to form and pour this concrete slab. So I I, I made up this sheet here for you. You'll be able to download it. But uh, I just want to make a video and just go over it with you real quick. So these are the tools you will need to form and pour your concrete slab. Now let's talk about forming. You'll need either a drill driver to screw your boards together or a hammer so you can hammer and nail your boards together. We we prefer to screw our boards together um, but either way will work. Uh, you'll need a two pound sledgehammer for pounding in your stakes. A laser level would be really convenient unless it's something a slab that's really small then you could just use like a four foot level or a six foot level. A string line to string the top of your boards to make sure they're straight when you're staking them into the ground. You'll need either two and a half inch deck screws or 16D nails, depending on if you're gonna hammer them together or screw them together. A tape measure, a pencil, your forming boards, whether you're using two by fours, two by sixes, two by eights, two by tens, or two by twelves like the ones in the video that we're using and then your forming stakes you could use wooden stakes make them out of two by fours make them out of strapping you could use metal stakes like we we're using um, whatever you have whatever's convenient for you hi everyone if you like this video go ahead and give me a thumbs up also if you want to see more of my videos hit the subscribe button and hit the little bell notification so you'll be notified whenever I put out a new video. And then for pouring the slab, you're going to need a straight edge of some kind. If it's a if it's a garage slab like we're doing, you know, if it's if it's just one time, you could probably get away with a straight 12 foot 2 by 4. Um, you could rent you could rent the straight edge like we're using at a tool rental place. Um, a bull float. This is something that you're definitely going to need. You'll probably have to rent this if you don't have it, or you can go out and buy it. But if you're only using it one time, renting it is probably the easiest thing. Those come-alongs are those rakes that we're using to pull the concrete around. The mag float we use to mag our edges. The grade stick for the laser level. And also the laser level when you pour also. You're going to need to shoot some pads to make sure this thing's level unless it's really small again like like six by five or five by eight something small like that you're gonna need rubber boots guys you gotta wear rubber boots if you're stepping in the concrete and gloves too you don't want to get that concrete on your hands and then optional if you're pouring a garage slab like we're pouring and the chutes from the truck can't reach you know the back edge you might want to rent an extension for that chute and a couple of notes I have down here on you for this sheet is my concrete yardage formulas. Just my simple formulas for figuring concrete. Uh, for four inch slabs, just take your length times your width and divide it by 81. And that will give you the yards you need. Five inch slabs is length times width divided by 65. And for a six inch slab, you'll want to take your length times width and divide it by 52 and that'll give you how many yards of concrete you'll need. There'll also be a link on this thing for a concrete calculator if you want to use that. Now just a couple other things. If you're gonna desire more of a smooth finish like a glass like finish you're gonna need a couple other things. You might need a power trowel to smooth the slab out with and you're gonna need a hand trowel to trowel your edges or just trowel the whole slab if it's small. So just a, just a reminder of the tools you'll need 
to successfully form and pour this concrete slab. Hi everybody. Don't forget if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell notification. We'll see you on the next video. Thank you.